Hi, I wanted to show you my latest purchase. This is a silicone liner, an 11 pound silicone liner from Nurture Soaps. I bought it, um, I was actually just buying Micah's, but then I saw it on their website and I saw that it was around $23. So I figured I'll buy it and I didn't buy the mold. Instead, I found this box from Amazon and it, all, it was almost a perfect fit for it. The only thing is that on the top, on one of the sides, you can see there is a gap. But I think that's not biggie. I can use something, paper or something, you know, to fill it up when I use soap. When I use it as a soap. And I also bought another liner that they had on sale. It's a green loft liner. It's a five pound. And they were having it on sale because it didn't quite fit their wooden mold so this five pound loft liner was around 27 dollars and what i'm using is i'm using the same carbock box in which it came as to make a frame i just cut it up and i folded it and then i added some tape on the edges just to protect the cardboard from oil or from soap when I make it, when I, whenever I make a, my next batch. So I'm pretty happy with that. I'll be trying that out soon. It will be helpful when I want to make a, a big batch of soap. Now I also bought some micas. I bought the Silver Mist Mica Powder and this is what, um, what I wanted to make the video to begin with for those who may be looking for a silver mica. Now in their website, they describe this mica as it being a uh, blue silver mica this is what it looks like on the window sealed under you know sunlight and if you look at it it does seem to have this blue or purplish sheen to it now prior to this i had uh, the bramble berry pewter silver mica which it's a pewter color so it's more of a dark gray i'll show you here you can see it's not as reflective as I wanted it to be it's not as silvery as I was hoping for however there's not a lot of uh, suppliers who sell silver mica it seems you can find gold in many um, places but silver for some reason is not as popular or it's not as well stocked so this is what the Bramberry pewter silver mica looks on the skin however I will try it on top of soap that is uncolored so you can see what it looks like usually when I use mica I will probably if especially if it's silver or gold I'm gonna mainly use it on top of the soap as an accent and not really to color the whole loft because I'm not gonna get that shimmer on it so I may use it maybe on clear melt and pour but not on actually to color the whole soap now I'm going to open the one from nurture soap and I'm gonna use it also on top of these other soap and as you can see it does seem to have a more of a reflection uh, it seems also a little bit more sheer than the one from Bamberberry, but it definitely reflects more the light. Now on my skin, I will show you what it looks like as well. So you can see the difference next to each other. So you can see it's brighter. It does have a little bit of a blue or violet um, tone to it, but I'm okay with that because it does seem to reflect it better. Next is the view in the window sill under natural light. I also bought though some other micas, this purple vibrance mica and this berry twist. And I bought the versions in the bag. They also have them in jars. However, I already have jars at home that I'm going to be pouring this into and it's cheaper when you buy them as bags instead of the yarn. 
anyway these are the colors that i got this was actually the main reason why i was shopping there to get micas and then i got sidetracked and bought the liners as well i also bought this sal silver bio glitter which i'm looking forward to trying soon and now what's next is with a gift an electric blue mica i wasn't expecting this it seems that they just included it with the order so i was really happy about it and they also included this maya gold mica i don't know if this is something that they always do i know that last time they did have me choose a free fragrance with my order it was like a one ounce sampler and this time i don't know if it's because uh, the shipping took a little bit longer than expected or not but i was happy anyway i also bought this clear low sweat melt and pour soap i was a bit surprised that it doesn't look as clear as most other soaps that i have bought that are clear so maybe when it's a thinner embed i'll be able to tell anyway this is all thank you for watching